Hey guys, Aloha here. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. And if you're an existing subscriber, how you doing? Welcome back. Thanks for joining me. So today I'm going to just cut right to the chase. This is going to be a voiceover video. I'm going to show you my everyday fall makeup look. This is the look that I go to when the weather gets cold outside. It takes me five minutes to do it. I pair it with a dark lip, simple eyes. Everything is so simple. It's so easy to achieve. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that today. And literally throw on a cute jacket, some boots, and you are good to go. You look very trendy for the fall. And your makeup is popping. So if you'd like to learn how to get this look today, please stay tuned and I would love to show you how to do that. But before we get started, you guys know the drill. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you have not already and turn on the bell notifications. So you guys are notified every time I upload a new video. And with that being said, let's jump right on into this tutorial. So the first thing I'm going to do is go in with my Proteiny Polypeptide Cream and apply some C Firma Day Serum and B Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum to it and apply this all over my face. These products are by Drunk Elephant, my holy grail. Next I'm going in with my Temp2 Primer. I love this primer even if I'm not airbrushing, it's just the best. It smooths out your skin and pores. Then I'm going in with my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Medium and I'm highlighting and concealing with this to prep my skin for airbrush. Once I have blended all that concealer out, I'm going to go in with my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and I'm just going to set that concealer in place so it doesn't crease or move underneath my airbrush foundation. Then I'm going to go ahead and buff it all out and blend it all out into my face. Next I'm going in with my Brilliant Glow Primer and this is in the shade Medium Deep and I'm applying this all over my face to really give me that radiant base underneath my makeup. The beauty about this product is that it can also be used on top of your foundation. It doesn't have to just be used underneath. Then I go in with my Perfect Canvas Foundation by Temp2. This is in the shade 9N and I'm just spraying this all over my face in a nice layer to give my face that flawless coverage. And I love this foundation. You guys know I love to airbrush because it really feels like you're not wearing anything on your face no matter how much you apply. To contour, I'll be going in with the shade 11W and I'm literally just spraying this into the hollows of my cheeks, my temples, as well as my jawline to chisel and contour my face. The highlighter I'll be going in with is Pink Pearl, also by Tem2, of course, and I'm just hitting the high points of my face with this highlighter. And the blush I'll be going in with is called Pale Pink, and I love this blush. It's kind of like a corally color, and it just gives the cutest flush on your cheek. Now, to fill in my brows, I'm going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Duo Powder in the shade Ebony, and I'm using the light shade for the front portion of my eyebrows and the darker shade for the tail end of my eyebrows. Using my ABH and Amrezy highlighter, I'm just applying this to the inner corners and my brow bone to give my face a little bit of a glow. I just think this really brightens up the eyes and just makes everything look so much nicer. So I'm like in love with it. Then I'm going in with my Hoola bronzer. I'm using this to contour my nose and I contour my nose with powder because it's a lot lighter than going in with the airbrush foundation and doing it. And because my eyes are so sensitive, I can't spray that close to my eyes. So I also take this Hoola bronzer and I apply it with a fluffy brush into my crease to kind of give my eyelids some dimension and make my eyes look a little bit more alive. I also like to take my Amrezy highlighter and just apply this to the bridge of my nose to give the look of a more narrow nose. Next I'm going in with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is one of my favorite daily wear mascaras. Um, it really just coats your lashes nicely and makes them look very very long and full and I'm just applying this to my eyelashes. I'm lining my lips with the Crayon Case Plum Lip Liner and this is just 
preparing me for lipstick. I always like to line my lips. I don't have to, but I like to do it just, I don't know. It just makes applying lipstick easier. Then I'm going in with my Hypnoti lipstick. This is in the shade Naughty, and it's like the perfect wine, like deep red Merlot color. And I absolutely love this shade for fall and winter. Okay guys, this is the finished look. I really hope you enjoyed this very quick and easy tutorial. You can pair this look with a cute cardigan, a blazer, a jacket, a coat, throw on a belt over it, put some cute hair accessories on, throw on some boots, and you have the perfect Instagram worthy fall look. Take your pictures and look poppin' girl. Hashtag fall 2019. So yeah, as always, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and turn on the bell notifications. So you guys are notified every time I upload a new video. And if you're not following me already, please go ahead and follow me on all my other social media outlets. I have Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. All of that is at Makeup by Alaha. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for staying until the very end. I love you all so much, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.